Let's watch some from Catfish. Very excited. This episode is called Six Incredibly Awkward Catfish Meetups Part 2. I, uh, I didn't watch Part 1 yet, but it doesn't really matter. The order. It doesn't matter. I'm going to switch on over here. I know we're very excited to watch some Catfish, as we should be. Here we go. The first one here, Joe and Mike. Most I probably have not seen most of these. BRB, I'm getting a matcha for Sammy's influence. I am so sorry to hear that, Noel. Here we go. Is it weird seeing her? It, it's awkward under these circumstances. Sure. <laughs> but, like, just have you them, been... Just, just let them okay. be weird with each other. Here it is. We made it happen. Now, you guys... Why is she on the floor? Anything else you got to ask? What's this? Here's Mike and Joey. Um, Man, those are some short one. shorts. Those are some Brian shorts. Um, what? Hi. Damn. Ew, what the f who, who is this? He just said, Hi, ew, what the fuck? Joey, he did not just ew, say, what the f oh, that's fucked. Who, who is this? Somebody say, ooh, what the Hi, fuck? I'm Joey, how are you? Oh, no. your name is Joey. No, I'm Mikey. Oh, you're Mikey. Yeah. Hi. Mikey. Oh, my God. Hey, when someone hits you with the... With this, that means you they don't want they definitely don't want to talk to you. Hoochie daddy shorts. That's so sad. Hi, Jane. Hi. Nice to meet you. I Wait, you know each to... other? We used to be best friends back in the day. Oh Hold shit. On. What's the what was the well, whole point? I of this? wanted to break his heart. Like I got oh, mine broken. Yeah. He had this like notion out of nowhere that I slept with his now ex boyfriend. Out of nowhere, even though I witnessed it, you know, with my two eyes in person. Your boyfriend's trying to get with me. Uh -oh. You're with me, you need to stop. First of all, put your hand down. No, that because serious. I don't want to look at you. So Next don't look at you. Your... I'm trying to keep up here, and I already believe Joey slept with Mikey's boyfriend. Mikey did not like that, obviously. Mikey said, I'm going to catfish you. Did it for a long time. Now they are meeting up. I think that's what we're... I think I'm caught up here. The other way. There's plenty because of space in the world. This is a reality show, not a f Also, I've never show. seen this I before. The other way. There's plenty of... You have the earrings inside the earrings. This is earring... Earringception. This is gauges, and inside the gauges are earrings. I'm not kidding. I don't know if I've ever seen that. This is a reality show, not a f horror show. I can't stand you. I can't stand looking at you. So oh my don't. God. Oh my Jesus. God. Like, don't. <sighs> oh, God. Okay. Time out. Okay. Yeah. Mikey. Who the fuck is that girl? Okay, where's I mean if Max isn't there, where's my where's my girl Ciara? Who's this? This girl looks like Megan. What's up, Icy? Her name's definitely fucking Megan. You and Mike had been pretty good friends. And at some point in your past, you had a boyfriend, and you're pretty sure that that boyfriend's Slept or hooked um, up. I witnessed it, but he's gonna deny it till the end. Whatever. Did you? That's his no, make I out with he, no, or... I never did. He wanted to get with me. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I didn't want any part what of it. He groped me, me, and that was it. I had no part of it. Not wanting okay. to do anything to that's do with cat. it. So, so, and then what happened so, after that? You that's left cat. Or... I didn't. I didn't leave the party. Of course not. But, but like, it didn't. Did it go any farther? I didn't go any farther with him. No. But how long ago was this that something happened? It was like winter. Is that when Joey started? Winter. When did Joey start? March. So your relationship ended because of what happened at that party? Oh, uh, yeah. And then you found him on Grinder and broke his heart as a sort of revenge. Yeah. Damn. I mean, I called that. I, I mean, I feel like... It's not acceptable, but I mean, if that dude, if, that, if his ex-best friend did that to him, that's like, that's pretty fucked up. So who's who's Joey? Who's I don't really like I don't really like Mikey so the way... I mean, I don't really like the way Joey's been reacting here, you know? I, I'm believing Mikey here. For sure, I'm believing this guy right here. Them guy yeah. that I found on Instagram. I don't even know him. Okay. I don't know, I think it's just, it's a sad story. You went five months talking to me and it got you nowhere. I'm still living my best life ever in California. You're still Are here. you really though? I Is am. living your best life living off of sugar daddies? I really Damn. don't. Damn. Damn. Just called him out. Fair for you to be judging him right now. You just. Yeah, you kind of took five months of his life and really? kind of upended it. He's he took my relationship and ended it. So even like if, if you were... I did get with your boyfriend, it wouldn't matter because I would have done it much better than you anyway.
Okay, that's an unbelievably insane thing to say. <laughs> that's the craziest thing I've ever heard someone say to try to justify cheating. I did get with your boyfriend. He said, if I did get with your boyfriend, it wouldn't matter because I would have. I would have done it better anyway. That's the weirdest thing I've ever heard. That's such a weird thing to say to somebody. Done it much better than you anyway. I'm going to beat you at everything you ever do for your entire okay. life. You will always be uglier, older, disgusting. Older? <laughs> we. That's so funny. Older? What do you age differently? Hey man, I age much slower. Okay. <laughs> You're like covered in like Cheeto dust. Damn. Uh, all right. I want to talk more. Can we just go like over there and have a talk without? You're covered oh, in yeah. Cheeto oh, dust. Oh my God, he is disgusting. Oh. Shoot, that was fun. That was kind of funny to be honest. Oh my God, what in the world? That was crazy. Okay. Here's Keith and Tay. Oh, what the this is more nerve-wracking. Jason and like Keith. There, okay, I like her. She's cool. Like the door will open or somebody will walk up. This, we don't right. have You could tell this was there shot during the uh, like pandemic times here with the damn Zooms. Is anybody else triggered by these old 2020 videos now where everything is a Zoom? I don't mean triggered in a negative way too much, but you know what I'm saying? Do you guys like look back and go, huh? Because I do. <laughs> Because every YouTuber, every blah, 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 there's a 2020 video with a Zoom call recorded or, like, something. And then it just looks so dated now, you know? Like, I never want that to happen again. Like, I thought I liked it kind of when the... This is what I learned. I thought I liked it when the pandemic pandemic was happening. I was like, oh, this is cool. Looking back, no. I'm not saying the pandemic was cool, but the whole Zoom and... That, uh... Eh. Yeah. Yeah, even somebody that's I'm more of an introvert than an extrovert. That's me. Like, eh. It's a bit cringe. Preparing this moment. Yeah, I guess unless... She's cool, Ryan. Oh, yeah, I forgot that I was going to marry her. Well, at least I'm, cons I'm consistent. So we made the Zoom calls. So maybe there's a way you can do it, like, so people have to request. Oh. Whoa. Oh, my boy Keith is coming in the call. Is that Keith there? First of all... Y'all can't just come barge into my life. Like, what is this y'all trying to do? Why do I have to reveal myself now? That's what I want. Oh, I thought the ceiling was talking. Why wouldn't you ever reveal yourself before? You have been scamming me for two years. I did not want to hurt you. What, what would hurt me? The vision of you? The oh, I'm excited for this reveal. Sight of your face? Like, what the is supposed to hurt me? Damn. I mean, obviously the guy in the picture, you feel like the guy is fake. But you still have been in love with me and my personality. But who are you? What of do course, I you Neve's house looks like this. And he has cool paintings that he just did. Of course. See, Alana? Like, of course. Of co like, What a creative human being. You still have been in love with me and my personality. But who are you? When do I get to see who you are? Like, you see me right now. This is exactly what you see. All day, every day, Instagram, okay, whatever. Okay, fine. All y'all coming at me sideways. Like, oh, shit. Nervous. I'm nervous. All right, hey. Yeah, okay, pretty normal-looking guy. Hi. What's the problem, Keith? Because I don't want to deal. Like, I'm already hurt. No, no, the, what, that's a very shiny mask. I have never seen a mask that shiny in my life. I'm embarrassed. Y'all got me on this camera. Now what? Like, what's up? You're an attractive guy. What is the tea? It's no tea. Wait, let's just clear. Let's just clear something up. So wait, Keith. That's your name, right, Keith? My name is Tay. 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 All right. Well, nice to meet you. And you live in Detroit. Correct. What do you do for work? I am like a model, a fashion model, and stuff like that. <laughs> Neve called him out immediately. He def not a model. That's fucked up, Neve. How do you know that? How do you know he's not a model? <laughs> is there a reason why you haven't? I think that is a leather mask. Years told him the truth. Yeah, they're ra they're roasting this poor man. Who you are? I really, I didn't mean, I, I didn't mean to catfish you. Like this is not, this is not a fish fry. But oh, that's fish the only fry. way that I could get with you. You didn't even try to hit me up this way first. So you never gave me the opportunity to get to know you. We actually met a couple times. Oh shit. And I didn't know how he was going to act because. Where? I met you in LA, out 
before at like a couple of clubs out there. We actually had conversations and exchanged numbers, but you never called the number. So I assumed at that point, like I wasn't your type and you know, you weren't feeling me. I meet a lot of people when I go out, but I don't know. I, I, I reveal myself, so now, like, y'all want to see the whole. Oh, well, I mean, you, you know, well, you just took off like one inch. I, I mean, out, but I don't know. I, I, I... How is this the? How did he make this a big reveal, bro? You just took the bottom of a mask off. That. I reveal my. I mean, uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, this is exactly what you look like a minute ago. Myself, so now, like, y'all want to see the whole. So basically, what you're telling me is that you don't even recognize me at all. No, I don't remember you. I don't have a Tay in my phone, period. Why Jason, Jason's great, but like why do all of this and go to such great lengths? Did you create this page and like customize it just for Jason? Yeah, Jason, he got, I don't know how I'm, I'm attracted to his lifestyle and what he do and what he can bring to the table. So that's what I like. Do you really like Jason for him or is it just what you see on Instagram because you you know he's popping. I mean, at first when it all started off, like it was like that. It was just like for him, it was for the lifestyle. But then once I actually got he's to know him for the clout. time, things did grow. And now I do have feelings for him. But I'ma just be honest, I do have a boyfriend in real life. Man, what the hell? You gotta go, you whack. Nah, listen. No, you, I don't wanna listen to you. Liar, <laughs> lying ass. Pause. Jason about to whoop his ass through the screen. He has did more for me over the two years than my actual, you know, oh, the person okay. who I'm dating. Jason, he buys me red bottoms and everything. What the fuck? Wait, what are red bottoms? I, I've heard that. The red bottom is a uh, type of shoe. What the fuck I spell bottoms like that? Red bottoms price. Christian Louboutin. Yep, I've heard that. How much are real red bottoms? Signature Louboutin. Uh, $6,000? Yeah, For what? $6,000? The fuck? Well, yeah, I mean, God, no wonder he likes Jason. Chris, don't lie. So that's what the money was for that Jason was sending you for red box? Suppose it was for a phone. Well, yeah, I did give me a pair of Christian Louboutins. So you want to have your cake and eat it too. You want to have a boyfriend in real life in Detroit. You want to have a sugar daddy that lives in LA. What do you think that this is? Tell your little boo to go get him a job where he can afford your lifestyle that you want to have. Let's go, Jason. Live, which neither one of you bitches don't get. Damn. I gotta let, say, let him I'm know. not really buying it. You seem like you made a profile to talk to successful guys who have following to see who will fall for it and send you money. You're like a con artist. I, I, that's the vibe I'm getting. <laughs> Let's go, Neve. See, it's like, and it's not even like that. My loyalty. Lies. That is a it's very, important. I am not kidding. I did think that that was a bike chain for a, a little bit. Like the chain on a bike, but that's okay. Anybody because I've been waiting for two years. Yeah, but I don't buy that because your aunt called and said for me to stop ruining a perfect relationship. Yeah, because strange people keep calling her phone. We didn't call her, she called us. Your aunt contacted us and left us a very sassy voicemail. She just don't want y'all just all up in my space because my boyfriend actually just like proposed to me two weeks ago. Man, get this guy out of here, bro. Get this guy out of here, bro. What is that tree in the background? I know it's like the damn Rainforest Cafe. Get him out of here. Your poor fucking boy just, man just proposed. Did you say yes? That means he's your fiance. So did you say yes? So you're engaged. You don't have a boyfriend. You have a fiance. This motherfucker, man. He's showing a ring off. I, I said yes. Here's my ring right here. I said yes. The wedding is actually in Cali. Sure. So I'll leave the wedding. What in I'll the hell? And I'll just replace the person who I'm marrying now with Jason. Or bye. Look. What did he just, just say? It's actually in Cali. Sure. So I'll leave the wedding the way how it is. And then I'll just replace the person who I'm marrying now with Jason. Or bye. Look. 
We gotta figure out what's going on here. Let's take a well, break. I mean, he certainly doesn't take life too seriously. Let Jason think about this and see what we want to do. Tay, we'll, we'll be in touch I met, with you uh, One time I met somebody, I met somebody, but it was a lady that worked at an Acme, which is a supermarket on the East Coast, especially Jersey. And this was like 10 years ago. She was older, probably in her 50s. And she asked me if I ever wanted to have kids. And I said, I don't know. And then she said that she was divorced 11 times. What's up, Stargirl? I think after the, the eighth or ninth, you might think that maybe it could be you. That's the issue there, possibly, maybe. But she 11 divorces. And she was, she, I remember she was like, she like wanted to talk about it. Yeah, I've been divorced 11 times. I remember being like, 11 times? I think I got scared of her at that point and like was like, oh, you might have, do you have like a weapon on you? Are you going to try to poison me with some sort of arsenic? Like, what the f she was trying to make you number 12. Well, she did. I, I do believe she did compliment uh, my array of snacks that I bought, but I did get out of there and escaped. Okay. Bye. Bye. Man, my boy, Jay. I mean, Jason. Ooh. All right. Here's Nicole and Nicole. Okay. Did not expect that. Hey, do you guys see anybody? Nobody. It's like a game of hide and seek. There's my boy Max. He's back. Got nothing. There's somebody walking way, way down there. What? So I'm not sure. Did I get Kaylee? Kaylee, if I didn't get your sub, which I might have. Thank you for the 20 months. I'm pretty sure I got it, but if not, Kaylee. If you're still here, thank you. Like, see someone? Yeah, they're like walking up this way. Do you see him? It's a girl. It is a girl. Oh. Is it? Holy. I. You know, know this person. her. Yep. Hi. Okay. Do, 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 do. Obviously, I was the one running the fake profile, so. What's your name? Erica. Erica. Max. Erica was nice in. Do you guys know each other? What's up, Tyra? Online. Are you? Are you? Hello, yeah. hello. I added her as myself on my Facebook page. Why? Um, I think I was slowly making that transition to tell her. Because I think the first thing I said to you was like, wow, that's crazy how people are using your pictures. That was. Okay, so far this is not awkward, but let's see how this goes. To get her to accept like my friend request and me as a person. And then we'll eventually kind of come clean about the whole situation. And obviously I know. Who right is that guy? The whole situation. Is now Neve is gone? Who's that? And obviously I know Ryan. Oh, what? You know who? What did you just say? And obviously I know Ryan. I don't know who that is. That's not true. I don't know. I've never met this girl a day in my life. I don't know who that is. The whole situation. This girl is lying. And obviously I know Ryan. No, she doesn't. It's Erica. Mm -hmm. Ryan? No, I don't know who that is. That's crazy. I don't even know what to say. Yeah. Oh, I did not even recognize her. Yeah, I low-key dated Ryan. That's also not true. And second of all, what? Like 10 years ago. Yeah. <laughs> Ryan. Do you remember that? I remember that, but I didn't recognize you walking up. Yeah. This man dated her and didn't know who the fuck it was going on. Long time. First of all, I did not date her. She's lying. You guys dated in high school? No. Yeah. Like, oh, we okay. didn't date for no. like three weeks. Continue. Okay. So really, no, we the didn't. profile got started is because when me and Ryan were dating, no, um, that was kind of during the time my mother was just not about like I was not dating her relationships, can't talk to boys, nothing. So we were told not to talk to each other, like no communication, nothing. Good. Me being you know head over heels kind of person, I was like I need to talk to him. I you know was on MySpace. I think I had MySpace and Facebook, and. There was this like account called like Fake Busters, where they used to bust like fake profiles. Her pictures were one of them. I mean, she had like a YouTube video saying she was real. I was like, dang, like this is kind of like the perfect person to use. You know, if someone wanted to call me out. Well, hey, here's the YouTube video saying like I'm a real person. <laughs> Damn. I was the pawn. <laughs> but it it kind of enabled me to still talk to him and him being kind of receiving of it. Other than that, it's kind of been like a one and done 
kind of conversation with other people. Glad I know that now. Well, we know that you did reach out to like other local Cleveland people. Yeah, um, that profile was kind of the almost like last word profile. I mean, throughout the years of like high school and just like bullying and all this, you know, kind of just drama, people would always block me on my personal page and like would say whatever, then block me. And I'm like, really? As okay. weird as this is, this is, she is unbelievably articulate with explaining everything. It's so bizarre. Like, this is very bizarre. Okay, so I just hop on as Nicole and, you know, get my last word in and then that was it. Why not just shut it off? I, you can just deactivate a profile. Right. Um, so... Why is it still up? I mean... like, using her pictures and her name. Right. And then, separately as yourself, like, being friends with them. It's like... It's kind of... my life up in a way. And me personally, and I'm not saying that this is an important issue, but I had other things going on in my life she that I was take it over Ryan. Like, I don't right, blame I'll her. I'll get to this later, so... I won't get to this later, so okay. Weird. Do you guys have anything more you want to say? Jesus, right that dude has a huge setup. Look at this. The budget went up. Jesus. Good for him. I don't Cole? know. I'm so upset. Okay. I think they're pretty shocked. And they need to kind of process all of this. Go back to the hotel and maybe meet up God tomorrow. damn. Okay. <sighs> Sorry about that, chat. I did not tell you guys about what happened with me and Arika. And um, I'll come clean. It's so weird. I didn't recognize Dude, it. Dude, I saw her come up the hill and I'm like, I know this bitch. All these people. Let him come down. Now we have Jed and Skyler. Don't worry. Okay. That is a small garage door. That's the smallest garage door in the world. That's the smallest garage door I've ever seen, ever in my whole life. Comically small. That doesn't look like a Skyler, but... Oh, I believe it's not. She does not look happy. Jen is not looking too pumped here. How you doing? Good. Neve. Hi. Hi. What's your name? Um, Brian. Brian. Uh, God, it almost got another Ryan! We got so close. Ryan forgot to tell you I got my yellow t-shirt and I love it. Let's go, Mariana! Happy to hear that you like it. Happy to hear you like the yellow. I'm happy all around. Thank you so much. This is Jen. Hi. And uh, we brought her from Iowa, just like I said we would. That comes as a bit of a shock, I think, for Jen and also us, is yeah. that you're not the guy that we saw in the pictures, and your name's also not Skyler. Right. Yeah, I basically um, pretended to be Skyler because I never wanted it to reach that point where she would know who I am. So l let me just get this straight. So do you have true feelings? For Jennifer? I don't have any like emotional feelings towards her. Oh, poor Jen, look at I that. I would face. never be able to have like a, a romantic relationship with her. Then why the f are we here? Well, she's actually not the only girl I, like, I spoke to. And I felt like out of all the girls, this is like the perfect time. This is the perfect girl to, to finally come. Okay, here it is. Jen's excitement to meet Skylar, a guy she met on a gaming site, quickly disappeared when it became clear, like immediately, that the dude she'd been talking to was the worst IRL. Yeah, that's that sucks. Came to an end like Skylar. What are you ever hoping to gain from all of these half true friendships that you have online? What, what's the point? I wanted to like brush up my game and this is just something I do. You understand this made it not to say like he did to brush right? up his game. Yeah, yeah. Because I don't really give a f that Whoa, you. hold on, whoa. Hold on. That just lit Neve up. Hold on. That just lit Neve up. We get to see Neve all all fucking riled up. Let's go. Jen streams on Twitch. Does she really? Good for her. Let's go. Oh, man, imagine she came in here watching this. Oh, my God, that'd be crazy. Let's go. I want to see Angry Neve right now. Let's see how this goes. Huge right? He is being a huge yeah, asshole. Yeah, yeah, because I don't really give a that you wanted to come clean and set the story straight for all the other girls that you're being a to. Why did I bring this awesome, amazing girl from Iowa so that you could clear your conscience? 
because I feel like it's good for her to finally know the, tr the truth. And you, you could have told her that on the phone though, right? Yeah, but in a way I wanted to end Skylar and I feel like by telling Jen who I am, like that ends Skylar. Right, but that's all about you. That's you taking care of your business and not really caring about how that's affecting someone else. It's kind of selfish. Yeah, a little bit. Jesus, what? This guy is... Not, I don't know if anything's going on in that brain. Kind of selfish. Yeah, a little bit. I mean, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think there may, may be nobody home. Maybe nobody's answering that the, the door. I don't really care anymore. <laughs> Dude, why is he just standing there? First of all, I'm really impressed at how well you're Probably handling this. W for Jen, though. So, you're literally fishing and hooking girls and then just kind of tossing them back into the ocean with scars. I would just, yeah, I would stop speaking to them. But are you sorry? Or do you feel like you kind of didn't do anything wrong here? I don't know if I'm sorry, but it's... Yeah, no, he's it not. Is what it is. And I was giving her like a gift of being in that that relationship. You were giving her a gift? Yeah, I, I mean, she was happy, and I know I was leading her on, but I knew it would never be permanent. You told us on the phone that you. Bro, I, I I'm not even. I, I, you know, I, what what do you even say to that? What do you even? There's nothing to say. You don't even have to say anything. Man thinks he's an alpha. Right. What in the world is he trying to say? Just like admit you made a mistake and apologize and try to figure it out. But what in the what? Like, look at him. He's just kind of emotionless. It's very bizarre. I'm with Neve, bro. No wonder I'm out of here. Had real feelings for and wanted to see. Let's see what Max does here. Where this would go. And, and then you just kind of come out here and just straight up are like, I had no emotional feelings. That's what you said. Yeah. Which is not what you told us on the phone. Yeah. I think you got to take a hard look in the mirror and ask yourself what you're doing. It just seems really shallow that you would lead these girls on to brush up on your game. I guess it could, it could seem that way, yeah. You're going to have a shallow, miserable existence, and people are going to think you're a douchebag. There you go, Max. I guess I just don't understand like what he was saying with how he was trying to like brush up on his game or whatever. You've got an opportunity That's a very now, weird thing to say. All the girls that this guy's been playing with to tell him exactly how you feel about him. But I encourage you to consider that. She's about to go ham on him. Okay. Oh shit. Let's go, Jen. It's rampant. He's just standing there. This is so he's like a sim. He's like a sim. When you don't tell him to do anything. He's just like a fucking sim, a true sociopath, legitimate Zach. He is a, that is a that is a legitimate sociopath. We joke about stuff sometimes, but that's I think this guy actually is a sociopath. You know, doesn't have feelings, doesn't know how to have empathy, doesn't know what he's doing wrong. A NPC for sure. I thought you liked me, and apparently these other girls thought that you liked them too. And you didn't consider how I felt, and you lied to them. And you're wasting all of this time, and you're wasting my time. Why did you even come down? I wanted to come clean to you face to face. But what, did you want to come clean to me? Or did you just want to feel better about yourself? I wanted to come clean to you because I felt like you were, you were special. You have a cool personality. You're different than most girls. He did not just hit her with the you're different than most girls. So you picked the coolest girl to reveal how much of an a you were. Let's it's go, more Neve. Of a move to lie. But are you even admitting the fact that you're a or are you just saying it because all these people are looking at you? No, I felt like it's the best thing to come clean to you. I don't even know if I believe that. I'm very, this guy is actually scary a little bit. Is he? Did you consider the fact that I did like you? No, I didn't. I wasn't as um, concerned about your feelings. By successfully avoiding being yourself with 
the handful of girls that you talked to on the internet, you've now revealed yourself. I keep forgetting that he wasn't talking to them as himself either, that he was a fake person. The way he's speaking to them, it's like that he was just on a Tinder profile being himself. I keep forgetting that he is, he is the one catfishing her. It almost makes it it's so bizarre. Off to basically women around the world for being you know, exactly who you are. It's not a good portrait. Once it reached its peak, I would be gone. I wouldn't drag exactly. it on. Exactly. Where Two, would I be? Where would I be? You have a sense of self-confidence. I knew that about her. I knew that she would be stable. How did you stable. know? What you've done is cruel. Do you get that? No. Oh, yeah, I think something, dude, I, that's terrifying. Let's go, Neve. Good guy, it. Neve. Doesn't matter how much I stand here, and you really don't get it. That's a frustrating human being right there. I've never seen someone handle something so well. Why is she so good? She's handling it so well. Uh, like, unbelievably well. You've done an incredible job of being honest, holding true to who you are. He's a mess. That's gonna be frustrating. You're gonna feel anger and the resentment for him. But he's not even a mess. Okay. I don't even think he's human. All that matters is that you did what was that right guy was made in a you. lab somewhere. And the example that you're gonna set, and the people you're gonna help. Side note: the uh, interior, the seating looks very comfortable in this car. I know that's a weird time to say it, but it does. Through this, makes it totally worth it. Let's get the out of here. Dude, well, this guy's still standing there. Well, dude, well, someone should call the police and just tell them to come by. That was definitely crazy. That was a lot. Jesus Christ. All right, this one oh, is wait. Lawrence and Sierra. This is number two. Yeah, someone's coming. Uh, wait. What's up, Sorcha? Hello. Is that, is that Cece? If so, hello, Cece. Wait a second. <laughs> it's her. This is real? I don't believe it. Hi. Hello. That's Sierra. What? Sierra. Hi, Sierra. Hi. I'm Max. Hey. This is Lawrence. Hey. hey this is this is going well so far. This looks like a, a, a good-looking cup here. How you doing? Hey. Let's see where it gets awkward. So far, not. Is there anyone else showing up here too, or is it just you? This is me. So what, you guys were texting. Yeah. And you got a new number. Yeah. Okay. Hi, Max. Was it just you? I was like, okay, why is it number two, right? Because if it's the last one, what the fuck was that? How is anything beating that NPC? This whole time talking to Lawrence. Yes. Clifton. Clifton, that's my friend. But why does he texting with Clifton's phone number? Because I was using Clifton's phone to text him because my phone is broke. But oh, okay, hold on, it's getting a little weird now. Clifton is your friend. Yeah. And you actually have been texting from his phone. Yes. Because you know we found a few Facebook pages for you. Are those why do you two. have two? I have two Facebook accounts. Right. You do. One is old, and then I have a new one. I do hair. So one was more for my professional. Is, is there anything that we don't know? Um, that maybe you're married. What, what is she going to say? She has 90 kids? What's going on? There's got to be something. Max senses something. Yeah, his, his spidey senses are tingling. What do you mean by Catfish Dream? It is uh, a show that was on MTV, probably still is, called Catfish. Pretty loved show. There's millions of clips on the internet, and it's very entertaining. Do you have kids, or I don't. I don't have kids. Okay, I'm no not kids. Married. Here's the big question: Were you corresponding with Lawrence during a traumatic time in his life? Yes. It's her. All it's right, been her the whole time. Right. It's you. It's you. It's you. You were right. Look at this. Okay, hold on. <laughs> what? <laughs> What a lovely young lady. We're done. All right, you guys. Yeah, you guys did we, MTV, we did somebody anything. forget about something in the editing bay? Somebody forget about something? Did you mean to put this in another compilation? I think this might have I think this might be a mistake. I'm not even kidding. I think someone might have put this. Uh, we vetted, we vetted oh. this. Lawrence, 
words, can you talk? <laughs> can you yeah, say? Say? I, I think I can Catfish say Catfish got your tongue? <laughs> it's all you, Lawrence. <laughs> I was so nervous. I did not know what to expect. I was shaking. What? Literally coming here. What? I was just nervous. For what? I didn't know what to expect. Are you nervous? It looked like you was a little nervous. Why did she just say nervous so much? I feel like I was having a stroke. Did she just not say it like four times in five seconds? What the fuck does that mean? It's all you, Lawrence. <laughs> I was so nervous. I did not know what to expect. I was shaking. For what? Literally coming here. What? I was just nervous. For what? I didn't know what to expect. Are you nervous? It looked like you was a little nervous. Huh? You no, was nervous? Just, no, no, Dude, she did just say it like five times. She's promote nervous for no reason. Uh, you was nervous. Was I nervous? No. It looked like you was a no, little nervous. It just turned, it just the way it turned out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <sighs> yeah. I'm glad it's you. It is. Mm-hmm. Okay, kids. How's it going? You hungry? You want to get out of the cold? We're getting along, right? Yeah. yeah. Should we all just go get lunch and, like... <laughs> okay, it was awkward. I guess what they're saying is true, MTV. I take... That was awkward. Why did he not... What's going on? I guess maybe he's just shy. <sighs> yeah. I'm glad it's you. It is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, kids. Should we all just go get lunch and like <laughs> hang out a little bit? Okay, yeah, I mean, like that was fine. Yeah. The one before that was crazy. Hey guys, wait for our lovely guest. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. Yeah, it me too. Out. It never works out. How are you feeling? Uh, you in like a little bit of shock? Yeah, a huge, huge, huge shock. So I'm just trying to see how I like feel and stuff like that. So I'm thinking about a lot of different things at once. So. All right. Well, let's enjoy. Ah, just, just you know, take it easy. I think he's super nervous, but like I don't know if he's. I don't know what his problem is. I think he's gonna bungle it. No, he's 19. What is going on? He's playing it cool. I think. I know he's like freaking out. Well, I think he's trying to. <laughs> No, he, I know he's like freaking out. Hey. Hey, you're back. <laughs> okay, so wait, so hold on, real talk. What do you think of Lawrence? He is fine. <laughs> he is fine. He is everything I thought he was. What took you so long to, you know? Have a seat. We're just catching up. I like catch up. Yeah. He just said, he just said, like, catch. He said, I like ketchup. Hold on, he did not just... We're just catching up. I like ketchup. I like ketchup, too. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, this is a real treat. It is not every day that we have two people who are who they said they were. So? What are you guys going to do tonight? Saturday night? Saturday night. You don't have plans, do you? What is going on? This is hella awkward. What the fuck is this? What's up, Brianna? If I have not said hello to you and you're in the chat yet today, uh, please type hi or hey or yo or we or we as in like Nintendo we or we as in Paris. Because I don't know what the fuck is going to happen here and I'm a little bit nervous. What's up, Jess, Hannah, Guap, Mariana, Nicole, Jada. We got multiple Jadas in the chat. Many Briannas in the chat. Julia's. Many B Julia's. Amber, what's good? Rach, what's good? PTV in the house. What's good? Jess1014. Ariel, how are you? Angela. Lord Stella. Hello, Sammy. We got three Sammys in here today. Jazzy. Sweet Potato. Hello, hello. Hello, Taylor. How are you today? Is it still morning? Yes, it is still morning. Piper, hello, hello. Meaty, how are you? Are you nerve? I'm nerve for no reason. This promo is, is fantastic for me in this episode. We can use this. What's up, Kiki? Baby Ray, hello, hello. Mel, how are you? Corin, hello. Angelina, Aria, what's good? Hello, everybody. See, there are a lot of you that were just chilling, so there you go. All right, let's see what the... 
frick is going on here with our boy Lawrence? Hey, Lawrence. Why is he so plans, nervous? Like he has a plans, secret Lawrence. girlfriend? Yeah, Jess, you might be right here. Now that we know it's you, you guys can make some plans, right? I mean, I hope you're both down to hang, right? Mm-hmm. She Wait, so seems super about it. <laughs> Come on, what's good? Yeah, why he's eating fries like a what's psycho? Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Real talk for a second. It's gonna require some effort. Chat is something about to see each other. Yeah, he I might. Mean, he might have, have a secret life. Time. But you know, I'm college are in. coming up. Thanksgiving, you know, things coming up. You know, yes, no spoilers, please. Up. Nobody usually does in our chat, but just in case, would be interested in we like to watch these like, up again sometime soon. Live, I even a, probably, knowing me, I watched this a year ago, but I forget shit. So that's the beauty of our streams. I'm like a goldfish. We can just redo shit because I'll fucking forget about it. So it's wonderful. When you have the brain of a goldfish, everything is refreshing. Okay, great. All right, I'm gonna say Chris Brown a little bit. Other, Uncle Neve and Uncle Max are gonna be really We're gonna be bummed. He yeah. is definitely very. <laughs> this is weird. You, you needed us to bring you together. Yeah. You shouldn't need us to keep you together. Yeah, definitely. I can tell Sierra doesn't mess around. It's not Sierra I'm worried about. Uh oh. <laughs> he kind of looks like J o Odell Beckham and and Chris Brown, which is two good people to look like. Oh yeah. In terms of looks. All right, I'm over this lunch. Huh? You didn't like it? No. You don't like anything. You are picky. Sorry, guys. That's Sorry. good. No, it's good. This corn, terrible. Could have had nothing. Mm -hmm. Or perhaps... Oh. What the heck? Is that Clifton? No, it ain't Clifton. Oh, you gotta get that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Excuse me. Uh. Oh, look at the look at the lady. Look at, look at Nancy in the back. Uh -oh. Excuse me. Uh. You know she a producer, right here. She definitely one of those. They, look, they all are producers. Look, look at the producers. I, I've been there with K and J, where we got like me and Thomas or David. We got to sit like a bench with a hat and just discreetly act like you're not looking at people. It's like when we do like we did the one with Danny in public. Like me and David will be giving different things to tell K and J, and then people will walk by us and we'll be like this. Or if we get recognized and someone will be like, Ryan, David? <laughs> hey, how are you? What are you guys doing? <laughs> um, nothing. Dude, it's so, I get these people. It's so awkward and that shit happens. It's so fucking awkward. <laughs> Why is he so mad? What? What's is he acting on? weird? I mean, I don't know. I didn't, it just wasn't that what I would think. What are we, would you, are we what do you think? No. Uh, what would you think? I would think he would be more so interested in me because I was interested in him. He's trying to escape. You feel like he's not showing the end. I mean, it's just a little, oh. I don't know. Oh, weird. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, but definitely that same guy in the background. Mystery call. Man, this, okay, hold on. You know he was stressing, right? And I'll tell you how you know this man was stressing. This man was in the going through the emergency exit only lane. Okay, that's how you know that you, you've got a lot going on when you're going. Th look, he can't even get into goddamn gate now. Look at him. Oh. Yeah. And now Neve's laughing. There we go. He got in. You good? Yeah. Are we are we being like uh, annoying? No. It's a. Uh, uh, What's up? If this man doesn't just say it, uh, it's not. It's a little situation. Basically. I'm engaged. Of God, what is going on with the engagements? Oh shit! Whoa! Damn, some cyberpunk shit just happened. What the fuck? I'm engaged. Bro. Yeah. What the f are you talking about? Uh, yeah. It's. Did you not tell us? But you have a girlfriend. That's a big yeah. secret. Yeah. Legit fiance. It's a big yeah. secret, Wait, and I bet he doesn't have a fiance anymore. Engaged. Not too long, like a couple months. And you bought a ring and everything? <sighs> what are you doing? I, I thought it was like, like meeting her, but like. Now he's gotta tell, oh man, he's gotta tell her that he's engaged. No. Change, I don't know. The way, like, 
Like, I feel like I would just be feeling hurt, but like, I can't. Like, I'm actually like, I guess, in love with my fiance. As well, a Sierra, yeah. only confirmed for you oh, yeah. that you really want this yeah. other girl. Yeah. You need to know what's up because she, oh, she thinks you're acting kind of cold and that you're not into her, which isn't really what's going yeah. on here. All right, I mean, it still can, I don't know, no, work out in no. different ways. Like, no. she's still going to be don't like, don't try and, not like that, but no. like, yeah. you can't, you <laughs> up. Yeah. He still wants to be with, what? And now he's single. That's not fun and uncomfortable as it is going to be. I think you got to just be straight up. Yeah. Jeez, man. Oh, dude. Uh, Max is going to be pissed, but he's going to be like, I knew something was wrong. I feel like he's going to say that to him, but I knew something was up with that guy. You ready? <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay, well, I definitely have not seen this one before, I by the way. I think, Max, we should let them chat okay. for a minute. Let's give them some room. Hey. Oh no, hey. no, I hate how awkward this is going to be. This, that, I spoke too soon. I apologize. I made fun of MTV's editors. I sh I take that back. I suck. Great, I'm fine. Are you sure? Yeah. This is very awkward. Okay, so here's what's going on and why he's acting weird. Lawrence. Oh, I'm so excited for Max to find out. Engaged. What? Why did you not tell us about this until now? I don't know. Oh no. You feeling? You nice. good? I'm fine. Oh no. I'm fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh no. I'm so stressed out. Brianna. Thank you for the gifted sub to Riley. Riley28. And allowing me to take 10 more seconds to uh, relax from the secondhand embarrassment I am getting right now. So, I'm going to get serious right now. I was waiting for that. Yeah. All right. So, basically. Okay, well, motherfucker, let's go. Okay. You <laughs> Can you talk? <laughs> nah, I can't. Stop. Uh... Don't be sick. All right. You ready? You good? Yeah, thanks. Yeah. She's ready, brother. <laughs> so don't be mad at me or nothing like that. Babe. Hey, don't be mad. Hey, chat. Don't be mad at me or nothing like that. I'm about to tell you I have a fiance, even though you thought we were dating for two years. But don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. Just a little fiance. It's a joke. It was a prank. Basically, like, I'm technically, like, engaged or whatever. The way he just phrased that. Technically engaged or whatever. After this man just said, "Yeah, I don't want anything to do with Sierra. I am. I now I know I love my fiance. Now he says to Sierra, I'm technically engaged or whatever. I hate this guy. I hate this guy. Uh oh. Okay. That's it. That's it. What's, what was the point? So I can like meet you and like, I guess like see like what I wanted or whatever. Like, so yeah. Uh oh. Okay, so now that you met me, Ow. why do you have to see me to my face, sit down, eat lunch? I didn't know how I would feel until I'm here and it's like seeing you physically is just different. So. But you didn't talk to me. When we was alone, you didn't, you weren't saying nothing. Hell no. I was up. I couldn't understand there's nerves or whatever. Okay, but I don't see the point. For you to come all the way out here to see me, making me think, you're pretty, I'm coming to see you, I want to see if you're real or not. What was the point of that? Damn. For you to tell me you have a fiance? Talk your shit. It's just pointless. Pointless. A waste of time. Hey guys. That's what his response to that is this. A waste of time. That's his response. <laughs> I can't believe he's still sitting there. I'd be like, I have a fiance. I'm I would run. I'd be like, I have a fiance. Out. Gone. You would never hear from me again. I say I have a fiance. I'm out that bitch. Like what the hell? Odell, what are you doing, Odell? Hey guys. Sorry to interrupt. Uh, we're just as shocked as you are. I feel bad that we brought you into this. Yeah. I'm mad as hell. Like, that's embarrassing. She's handling you it very well. dating somebody 
and I've made the decision to get on my knee as a man and propose to her, it's no doubt in my mind yeah. that that is the one for me. It's no doubt. It's no reason right. to meet another. Especially if you propose, if you're if you're just married a couple months ago, you should be so head over heels in love that you're like, it's the only thing you should think about, in my opinion, right? Like if it's your f recent fiance, like what? Chick, cause she don't even matter. If you're having questions in your mind, that's not that, not a saying it ever makes sense. But let's say this was a thing where he was with somebody for nine years, and then the story was I fell out of love. Well, like there's some mental things with that. But the, your fiance of a couple months—that's so recent. That's crazy. So that you have to think to yourself. Just stay no, single. I tell us my friends like stay single, bro. It's okay. You can be single. You can be single till okay. you're 50 years old if you want to figure it out. out to do. Better that than you know. I agree. Unless there's anything yes. left to say on your part. No, I'm good. All right. <clears throat> Crazy. She handled that well, though. Give her. Oh. That's wild. How the fuck could anything be bit better than that? I. Kim and Matt, which should be Matt and Kim because that's a band. This is the last one. Everyone lock in. Six minute clip, and then uh, that'll be it for the stream. So thank you for the energy. Let's see this one. Kim and Matt. Matt and Kim. Uh-oh, yeah. I see someone. And I appreciate chat. When we watch these, you guys are always very good. You don't spoil nothing. I appreciate that. Thank you. Because that last one was wild. And I did not expect that twist. That could be him. I'm ready. It's time. Face your fears. Let's do this. Is this him? Sammy, can you put up a poll to see who people like more, Neve or Max? Because it's a tough one. And I'm really curious if we can get a winner real quick. Because I look at this, I'm like, man, Neve's awesome. And I see Max, I'm like, yo, Max is really awesome, too. <laughs> if I truly had a vote, I would probably say that my favorite out of the two is Neve. Because I think they, oh, man, because maybe Neve cares a 1% more than Max. I want to see. I'm curious in the poll. Imagine it's like 92% to like 8%. What do you guys like between? Wow, look at Neve. Look at Neve. Everybody vote. If you're lurking, I want to see. Neve or Max, the host of the show. Neve is dominating right now, chat. Are there any Max stands in the chat? Now is the time to step up. If you are a stand of Max, drop your vote. It's free. Over 100 people have voted, and Neve with, Neve, sorry, with 65% of the vote. Yeah, Neve does stand. Maybe it's the maybe maybe it's the glasses. You know, I don't know what it is. Neve has black hair. That's see that counts as an answer. In All right, let's see where you know. Hey, to the thirty-seven of you that voted Max, you are welcomed here. And the sixty-four of you that voted Neve, you are also welcome here. We got over a hundred people to vote. That's great. Of a tree. Neve's the king. Okay, the, he's our he's our king. Neve is our tick. Our okay. Hold on. Let's make sure we don't lose anything here. Okay, hold on. That shit just happened. The shade of a tree. There, Matt. Yep. Oh my goodness. Max. She What's knows up? Matt for sure. Thanks That's for, for certain. She definitely knows him. Matt is. Go I'm gonna say Matt's her ex-boyfriend. Just based off this reaction. So. I do have a few questions. Um, just out of curiosity, you got a girlfriend? No. Why no pictures of you? Why won't you send me any? Why is she? Never mind. Whatever. She's probably just nervous. This. She's very. She's. I thought she had a pee. I'm not even kidding. I don't like being in front of the camera. Okay, but for five years. Okay, not an ex-boyfriend. This girl. Whoa, five years. How do you not send her a little video just so she knows it's you or something? You are who you said you were. You weren't lying about any of that. She definitely so has to what's pee. The holdup. I'm a secretive person for the most part. I think the bigger question is, do you do you care about her? I do. In what way? Like, it would suck if something happened to her. She reminds me of like, a fidget spinner. That's, that's one way to answer the question. I mean, I care about you. I mean, I was there when your mom died. You were there when my grandfather died. I mean, that's kind of hard to, like, brush off. 
you guys uh, mind if I take a second? No. Come back yeah, here. Stay yeah, stay here. <laughs> yeah, you can do it. The hysterics are nice. Come on. Kim. This is uh, Kim. Interesting. <laughs> it's him. I know. It's... Okay, so it's the guy she expected. He's good looking. I know. I think she's obviously maybe freaking out a little bit. Which I understand. He's skinny, though. I know. I understand freaking out. I can fatten him up. <laughs> oh, I think she likes him. Wait, whoa, I didn't expect that answer. She, I can fatten him up. I can fatten him up. <laughs> okay, well, okay, okay, okay. That was quick. Okay. That was in there. What is going Why is she sitting back down again? <laughs> is it? She's got to pee. Just tell people you have to pee and then to get it Weird over. Weird seeing her. It, it's awkward under these circumstances. Sure. <laughs> But just like, have you been? Just, just let them okay. be weird with each other. Here it is. We made it happen. Now, you guys, let's see what happens. What is going on? Anything else you gotta ask? So, do you still back up. like children? I mean, iffy. Why? Um. Well, I haven't really been exactly honest. Uh oh. Um. I actually have an almost two-year-old daughter. Okay, that's a pretty big lie. Huh? I have a child. And you, you decided now to tell me? Yes. I mean, like, I get that I was lying, but can you really blame me? Like, I have never seen someone fidget in more than her ever in my life. Like, you told me to begin with, like, you don't like children. Oh Which leads me to my next question. Would you like to be her godfather? Hold up. Okay, she skipped about six chapters there. Holy shit. What, what did... I don't know. I got nothing. I don't even know what the fuck to say. I'm just going to replay it. Which leads me to my next question. Would you like to be her godfather? Hold up. I've oh, never that's even met her. I'm just now finding out about her. She just asked a guy that she's just met with for the first time who just found out that she has a, a daughter if he will be her goddaughter. I mean, Neve says it all. A child. Okay, now my anxiety's through the roof. She didn't meet you when you came to visit because? I bailed because I went into labor. Oh my god. Hey, sorry we couldn't hang out. I had a baby yesterday, but I'll see you tomorrow. <sighs> That's certainly a good excuse. Why don't you tell Matt how you feel about him? Do I have to do it with all of you guys? There, there's a bench over there if you want to sit. Yeah, you guys go sit. Yeah, this guy, go Matt, talk. is very, very <laughs> calm. Okay. The past five years, um, I can't say I didn't fall in love with you. The way she's talking I, to him with her, <laughs> with her hands in her hand. I guess I just have huge feelings for you. She actually cannot look at him. It is interesting. I get yeah, it. I get a little weird. Stare at me. Certainly awkward. I'm at a complete loss for words. Okay, so like this is really like pointless. I'm walking back that way. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. This is so awkward. I just want to see the water. Can we? Can we just? What? Talk? Sure. Can we just, yeah, let's you, take. Give us a minute. You get out give of here. Give us a minute. Great. Go. Can I go for a run? Yeah. Do Thanks. it. There's no. One. 
I refuse to believe this is not a comedy show. She's not about to run away, dude. There's no way. <laughs> That's the last thing I thought she would. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? Forrest Gump over here just took off, dude. Can we can we just talk? Sure. Can we just, yeah, let's take, give us a minute. Get out of here. Give us a minute. Great. Right. Can I go for a run? Yeah. <laughs> oh shit, dude. That's funny. God damn. Can I go for a run? Yeah. yeah do it. And there she goes. What in the Don't fall in the river. <laughs> Okay, so do you want kind of romantic thing with Kim what? or not? That I can't really decide right now because I'm still trying to process. <laughs> that's the girls running away from him. Everything that's going on. What? <laughs> what in the? I have to sleep on the whole thing and maybe get a clear head out of it. Oh Fine. my God, this lady tomorrow, is. It? But I think by the time what is you she, man? leave. She deserves some sort of clear answer from you on where you stand. Kim. I think maybe that, that that's enough for today. I think right, so. so. We'll we'll take yeah. Kim back to the car. Nice meeting you. Same. You me. <laughs> nice meeting you. You just asked her to be your goddaughter. Godfather, what? That was fucking absolute madness. From his like behavior, do you feel that he he's into it? Um, I got an uneasy feeling. Well, you're both awkward. <laughs> Does anybody know what happens after this? If they watch the real episode, that was absolute madness. <laughs> that was absolute madness. Kim saying, I guess I have huge feelings for you while covering her face was one of the most middle school things ever. Cringe things ever. <laughs> Dude. Oh my god. That was absolute. I am like at a loss for words. I don't know what to say. <laughs> that was crazy. Fucking A, dude. I've never... That was the craziest thing ever. The run... When she started going on a run... I don't even know. I don't even know what to say. I'm not even gonna lie. That, Cam, God bless Cam. I hope she does... I hope she's doing alright. 